In this video, we'll be talking about Virgo Sun in the seventh house. So if you haven't seen my Virgo Sun general meaning video, I definitely recommend watching that because we cover what different traits that Sun in Virgo carries. But in this video, we'll be specifically focusing on the seventh house expression of this placement. So if you have this placement, what this indicates is it indicates that you find a lot of energy in relationships and in obligations that you have and like interactions with other people on a one-on-one -on -one basis, so like one-on-one -on -one connections. And generally speaking, you're somebody that's quite inactive because the sun in the seventh house can show somebody that's indecisive or inactive or stuck, especially when they are alone. But when they have others around them or when they have an accountability partner, this is what sparks them and this is what ignites their energy levels. So you find energy through relationships and partnerships. Um, that's just the general meaning of a sun in the seventh house. With that being said, in Virgo, this is about work and this is about oblig um, service. And it's about uh, materializing objectives. So in the seventh house, this indicates that relationships or partnerships or obligations help you to find the energy to accomplish certain tasks or, or to do certain work. And generally speaking, people that have this placement will manifest a lot of um, obligations in their life, a lot of work a lot of things that come from other people. And that's because they invest a lot of their energy into interpersonal objectives or into partner objectives, like other people's um, objectives or other people's leadership. And like I said, um, when they are alone, they tend to be more inactive and they feel like less inspired and they're more um, contemplative when they're alone. They're just thinking. They're just balancing out all kinds of different possibilities or perspectives. Um, so yeah, you will always see these people in some sort of connection or in some sort of um, agreement with somebody else or some sort of relationship. Um, so yeah, that's basically what Sun and Virgo in the seventh house creates. Um, in addition, these people carry a lot of value in relationships and they will possess a lot of them. So the reason being is because the seventh house is associated with Libra and then Virgo, which is associated, uh, well, Virgo is the sun sign, but Virgo has Libra in the second house. So the second house is something that we possess. So a lot of times these people possess relationships or they possess the ability to see things from the perspective of other people. That's another thing. And a lot of times you can play like kind of like a magician role. Like you know how to cast illusions or create a perception that people can appreciate or enjoy. Um, but yeah, that basically sums up this placement. Um very straightforward and if anything else comes up i will we'll make a part two but if you saw yourself in this video or you enjoyed please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to this channel and um as well for nato chart inquiries or readings the information is in the description for that so if that interests you check that out as well other than that i'll see you guys sometime soon in another <clears throat> another video